this video intended for educational purposes. Hey guys, it's Adam aka Swimming Bird, and welcome back for another Minecraft snapshot. This is 13w11a for Thursday, March 14th. We are now in Minecraft 1.5.1 with this snapshot. Uh, there were a bunch of bug fixes that were actually pretty important to fix that weren't done before 1.5, and I think Mojang just wanted to get it out anyways, so next week, uh, probably around this time, we will have 1.5.1 already. But this is the snapshot for it. Now I can go through, there's actually one really useful feature added as well, so I'll go into that first real quick. Now enchanting books, as you know, you can get a lot of different things. I just got sharpness, I'll put that over here, because I have a lot of sharpness one, I've got power one. You get a lot of one books that you can't really do much with. Well now, if you go to your anvil, you can actually uh, combine your one books into a two book. You'll get the next level. And uh, I have a two book here, but so you can't go downwards. You can't go a power two with a power one. That won't work. And if you were to do the reverse, like a power one trying to do a power two, you would still get power two. So you have to do two books at the same level, but it will upgrade. And then if I got two of these power two books, then I can get a power three. You still can't go above the normal max with these for levels. Originally, it was like if you got one of those lower ones, you couldn't do much with it. Uh, so now you can actually use them and get really good ones fairly easily, so that is awesome. Now, the bug fixes that are pretty central, one of them I will show you with the Ender Dragon in a second here, but uh, first, paintings. This is probably one of the common ones that they really wanted to get out uh, quickly because people are going to get mad. Paintings, when you placed them, they would pop off of the wall and you couldn't place new ones and stuff, so that's one of those bugs that I think has happened before that they had to fix in a similar way. So we have that again, but now they place on the wall, they're fine. Uh, one of the bugs that you probably noticed for a long time, if you were to break a uh, sand block, as you can see in the clip here, there would be this kind of glitchiness, like the, the top one would fall, or it would like jump up and then fall, strangely, uh, as you can see. But now, if you punch it, it falls like normal, and it just goes down one. It looks very nice compared to what it used to, so that is awesome. There, uh, In 1.5, there were some weird white lines and black dots on the edge of textures for a lot of people. They wanted to fix that. Also, a few hidden changes to the Minecraft Realms feature were thrown in, but we don't have that yet. And the last thing here, if you turned mob griefing off, now I can show you, if you don't know that there's a game rule in the game, uh, there's a bunch of them, but if you do mob griefing, you can actually turn it to false, and uh, mobs like the wither and the ghast and creeper and ender dragon won't blow up stuff. So if I was to kill this creeper here, he'll blow up, but he won't grief any of the blocks around. So this is very handy if you have a map and you don't want your creations to be destroyed, but you still want monsters and stuff like that. And if I fly over here, man, the world is loading a little funky. This is a nice seed. This is the 13W11A seed. It has some crazy hills that aren't loading in correctly for some reason. Uh, so I've got a few ender dragons over here to show you. I've got mob griefing turned off, so they should not be able to go through any blocks. As you see here, they, they go through them, but they phase through. They don't actually destroy any of the blocks, which is very nice. Now, uh... The bug fix that they have for this one is that Ender Dragons were, even with Mob Griefing turned off, they could still break uh, cobblestone, chests, stuff like that. As you can see, he's just clipping through there. Uh, so yeah, now if you want an Ender Dragon boss to fight in the overworld, you can also just set Mob Griefing to false, and you're good. So that is awesome. I used my spawner from stacking the minecart on top of the Ender Dragon, so I've got this nice little seat so I can ride around on the Ender Dragon as he loads in new chunks. Okay, thank you guys for watching. He's going really far. Uh, <laughs> leave a like if you enjoyed this. I will have my 1.5 rundown out tomorrow to get all the new features in. But yeah, we're already getting 151, so look forward to that. Some very handy bug fixes already. Thanks for watching once again, guys, and I'll see you later. Goodbye.